What's up, Dharma Nation? Just want to show you guys some love. We've been talking about Instagram literally every single day. This is the last video you'll ever need to watch about content. Let me explain why. I got an email message from Daniel Silverstein. Thanks, Daniel. And he said, you know, how do you create your own content? Because we would post most of our visuals. We don't have text-occupied things like Canva. The topic is heavy and how can we be graphic? How do we balance the graphic pictures with videos and more live posts? Okay, so people always want to know like, Jane, what do I post? Like, how do I make people not click off? And guys, like, I would even take an acting class, right, mom? Yes. Like, stage presence and camera presence, you know, I am able to get your attention because I'm literally in your face. So, for in regards to content, you yourself need to be interesting. Now let's talk about topics. Come here, mom. We're at the library again, so I have a board. <laughs> so like, let's say this. For everyone confused on how to create good topics and what to like, what to create, I recommend you break down a couple of things. We got the macro. We got the micro. What this means is you have the general topic. For me, right now, I always say milk the cow. Milk the keyword cow. Pick your cow which means pick your topic of the macro. So for me, it's Instagram growth. But let's say you are an artist. Maybe it's rap, hip hop music. Just pick a topic. So I'm gonna say Instagram growth for my channel. Now guys, I almost am at the point where I'm able to, you know, move on to the different macro because you have to milk the cow. A lot of you guys do like, okay, I'm a lifestyle vlogger and you jump from many ideas. Pick one thing. If you're gonna do a day in a life, do a daily in life every single day. I'm telling you, if you post the same video, the title, just kind of flip flop it for the next 37 days, instead of doing like boom, 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 like random ass content scheduling, you're gonna see tremendous ROI. It's gonna be a lot better. Let me tell you why. Milk the content cow. This is the cow. This is the content cow. Okay, you gotta milk it, which means make sure you squeeze out everything in the topic. The way you squeeze it is by you go to the micro and you list out every single topic in the macro, which is Instagram growth for me. I don't know what you guys are wanting to do, but let's say you are some type of creative content machine where you tell people how to travel the world. You know, travel the world is one topic, but then you go micro, you say how to travel the world okay. for free. Okay, that's one topic. Now, next one. Sorry, the colors. How to travel under 16. How to travel when you're broke. You take the macro, which is how to travel, and you add in every single thing you can think about until there's no more. You milk the content cow. Okay, milk a keyword, milk a content cow, and that's how you make sure you own the traffic, you own this search. So when people search how to travel, you're the number one search. Just a little topic. Also, oh. Also, if you guys like this and you guys want more, let me know what you think below. I just thought I'd share this little tip and if you guys ever have a question, you know, Jade, how do I create topics? Pick something you're passionate about and milk it all the way until there's no more. For me, Instagram growth can go on and on. I have like 100 videos still planned. So make sure it's big enough to sustain you for a long enough time and it's actually something people search for. How to travel is popular, Instagram growth is popular, people don't search for your life. No one cares. Make sure you make videos that people search for. Tutorials, how-tos, live tips, stuff like that. So if you guys like this, I actually have merch now. You guys can see that below. I have some art that says milk the content cow. You guys can put it on your freaking laptops. Shout out to the winner. Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. So thank you so much for my designer, John, for designing it for me. You guys can choose to buy it if you want. It's a friendly reminder to always stay on that content cow run. Make sure you move out of the way and let the keyword cow, I know it's horrible. Thank you, mom. <laughs>